This is a dental surveyor. It's made by NA. And there's many different manufacturers. The dental surveyor has a cast holder down here. It's a part that has a couple of knobs and allows you to adjust both the tilt of the table and also put a cast in the, in the cast holder for analysis. So the top knob is used for fixing the cast to the cast holder. The bottom one is for changing the tilt or the path of insertion of the arch that you're using or the cast that you're using. This part here moves up and down. You can tighten it so it doesn't move up and down. You should adjust that so that it moves up and down but doesn't fall underneath its own weight. That's the surveying arm. It has instruments down here that can be changed. They're changed by uh, releasing the knurled knob at the side. This particular one is the most common one used. It's the analyzing rod. Here are two other common analyzing tools. These are the undercut gauges. They have a little lip on the end of them and you'll see up here they've got a couple of lines on the shaft. One with one line is a 0 0.01 inch undercut gauge. The one with two lines is a 0 0.02 inch undercut gauge. The last uh, surveying tool that you'll use is the carbon marker. It comes with a piece of carbon and also a metal sheath. When you place that into the surveyor, you want to place it so that the carbon marker is showing a little bit below the metal sheath and you want to put the metal sheath so that it's on the opposite side to where the knurled nut is for fixing that to the surveying arm. It goes in that way, this jaw tightens up against the metal and if you don't tighten it too tight, it won't break the lead. When they're not in use, a good place for your surveying tools are down here on the base. That way you can get to them when you need them and they have easy access. When you're transporting your surveyor, it's a good thing to take these tools out so they don't fall out and get lost. You can put them in the top up here, screw that on. If you're taking your surveyor to the lab or that, you can actually take your surveying uh, table uh, your cast holder and actually tighten that on the shaft so it doesn't fall when you're moving.